Hi, I'm Jay here along with my video videographer Bella and we're here to talk about the school renovations. We recently have been talking about the renovations for our community and for our school, but now we get to talk to the whole division about our renovations that we are so thankful for. Today we are going to interview Mrs. Penny Calvert, our principal at Kyle Compsa School and the superintendent from Quarex to talk about the renovations. We'd also like to thank the Ministry of Education for their funds for this renovation. I'm here with Mrs. Penny Calvert to talk about the school renovations. So, Mrs. Calvert, how, have, how has the renovations been on the staff? Has there been any stress? Um, in the beginning, yes, there definitely was. Just trying to move over from one side to the next and get settled in our new spaces, that was pretty stressful and we weren't sure kind of what the noise level was going to be, how often we were going to lose power, that kind of stuff. So we were definitely, I would say, stressed at the beginning of this, but as everything has gone and it's gone really quite smoothly, I would say our stress level has come down quite a bit and now we're just focused on the excitement of everything that's happening and waiting to see when it looks like. What opportunities do you hope to see in the future when we are in this part of the school? Um, I would say for opportunities, uh, there's some new technology that teachers are going to be able to use. So that will be exciting. Having a bright new space that just provides its own opportunities, a new learning commons area that we can really focus on doing some bigger group work, that kind of thing. So I think just there, the opportunities are limitless with the new space. And how do you feel about the renovations? Do you think they're going smoothly? Do you, do you enjoy it? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I do. I'm, I'm really impressed. I think the communication from the construction company has been really, really wonderful and that has helped so that I can then keep the communication going with the staff. So I, th I think they're going well. I'm, I'm pleased with the progress and hoping that it continues right till the end. Okay, thank you very much Mrs. Calvert. You're welcome. I'm here with Josh McCory, the superintendent from Corex, and I'm here to ask him a question about how things are going with the renovations. So how are things going, Josh? Things are going pretty well. Um, we're progressing through multiple different stages. So we've got the mechanical and stage additions off the gym, framed up, steel, um, ready to start boarding pretty soon here. We've got some structural demo throughout. Um, you've got some stuff in the south end there. There's a principal vestibule canopy area. There's a bunch of structural going on there. That's finishing up. Uh, there's ongoing rough-ins. That's for mechanical and electrical. So stuff like your electrical plugs, your water lines, your sinks, um, toilets, all that. Um, some more framing going in in the south end. So that'll be like the K to two, K to two room south end. Um, we're going to be doing some more structural demo, opening up the stage wall, going into the new stage soon. So we got that slab poured last week, and yeah, just kind of getting ready for finishes we're going to start doing some boarding in through the washrooms the washrooms are all that washroom bank is all ready to go and board that up and you know hopefully be at painting stage in some areas within a month or so a month and a half do you think things are going by smoothly do you think timeline wise it's going smoothly or do you think you're behind in anything I would say we're pretty close. We're ahead on some things. Um, we started a little behind just due to the uh, piling. Piling's the, the foundation, right? And so when you schedule a job, you end up with uh, being beholden to the, what the piling rig when they can show up on their schedule. So we started the job about a week behind with that. We maybe lost a week with weather, cold weather. We had some random cold minus 40 weather. Mm -hmm. So working through that, but yeah, no, we've caught back up in most of the areas. Um, so I'd say the majority of areas were either on schedule or ahead. And then there's just a couple little things that we're behind on, but that's something I plan on making up in the next you know, month or two. Well, I think that's it. Thank you very much for spending the time with us. No problem, thank you. Thank you all for listening. We are excited for the renovations to be done in the future. For more updates, please check the Sunwest School Division's website.